Hi, it's Aaron. Today, I wanted to use the Amazon Poly to test to read my article. The article is about the security plugins for the WordPress site. If you are interested in, please keep listening. Do I need a security WordPress plugin? I am not a tech person, I am a designer. So, this article will be 100% based on a personal experience. No commissions, affiliate links in this article. Do I need a security plugin for the WordPress sites? I thought it would, and it does. When I started to use the WordPress to build my blog sites, I purchased some premium plugins wishing to protect my sites. After a few days of install, I started to see errors and slowness. So, I contacted the hosting company to ask what's going on to all my sites. They uninstalled all my plugins and started to install one by one to find the issue. Yes, it was a security plugin had a problem. This plugin was not compatible with other premium plugins and DV theme. Hmm, so I contacted this plugin's vendor. They had some time to check my sites and suggested to uninstall some other plugins that are not compatible with. That solution was very unhelpful because I had to use them for my sites. This premium security plugin is the amongst expansive and popular. But, it does not work for me. So, I moved on to the other security plugins that are offering good price and many other seems using them. It also happened the same. I had a chance to work with so many local website design companies. They used only one free plugin, WordFence. Not a paid version? But, this free one to the business website? I asked why they do not use the premium, popular, expansive plugins? Hosting company does the scanning. When the real hacker attempts to break your WordPress site, they will. Since I heard many opinions and real things happening to the sites, I started to think to focus on the backup, not blocking the DDoS or scanning spams by premium plugins. If you use the site ground for your hosting, they will do the backup your sites for you. Everything is a free service. If you use any other hostings, you can ask your hosting provider if they offer the backup service for you. Be aware. If you try to use the Fiverr cheap service to back up your site, this may break your site. They may do correctly on light and simple websites, not old and heavy sites. So, in my opinion, to use the hosting provider service will be best to back up your sites. One more thing, I receive so many promotional emails about the security service or the plugins. Don't buy it even the price is so low or SEMA trusted people are promoting it. If it's a JVZoo new software, I would never test it to my business site.